A Pennington County Sheriff's deputy helped save a man from a burning building Monday night. It happened as flames were engulfing the Cactus Cafe and Lounge in Wall. Tonight, Kelloland Sydney Thorson introduces you to the fast acting deputy, Chris Lindquist. Deputy Chris Lindquist was on patrol when he spotted smoke coming from the Cactus Cafe and Lounge. He ran to the building and could hear people on the roof screaming for help. It was four civilians that were yelling and screaming that somebody was inside. Uh, I could not see anybody inside at the time, but they were able to eventually get his arm out of the window. And at that time, I was able to run up and assist them with yanking him out of there and getting him down to safety. It was a quick decision and a dangerous situation. It was rapidly evolving, and you have to weigh the pros and the cons and the safety of the public versus my safety as well. Um, but ultimately, we were able to get him out there safely, and it was a, a good conclusion. While Deputy Linquist was able to save lives during Monday night's fire, he did lose something very important. My wife, I thought she was going to kill me. I lost my wedding ring during the incident. So when we pulled him out of the window, my finger racked on the, on the window and the structure collapsed after, after we you know, got the people to safety and everything. So. Deputy Lindquist knows he put himself in danger that night. He was treated for smoke inhalation. He also knows he couldn't have done it alone. I just want to thank uh, all the volunteer fire departments and everybody that responded, all the first responders that uh, save lives every day. In Rapid City, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News. And Deputy Lindquist is already back to work. He feels just fine today after being sent to the hospital after Monday night's fire and is ready for his next shift.